Hey guys, and welcome back to some more Vine Wise. So today is a Thursday. We are using Cosmic Cuba. The deck with so much revival. This deck has so much revival. Yeah, I, sometimes it just like uh, the Glimmer Reverse, Call of the Haunted, the uh, uh, the Phantom Spring, like the, 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 lots of revival. But hey, the revival helps you go off with your single plays. There's a revival right there. Of course, and there's another revival. And I said there is so much revival in this deck. It is ridiculous. But hey, the revival helps you go off with your plays. The revival is one of the key things that helps you go off with your plays. You know, because he's gonna kill my uh, my uh, Chi Wen, but I can just summon like a. a La 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 Hasua, and then you know I can go ahead and spring back the Chi Wen, and then summon the Bixie. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and I can go right into uh, what the fuck is his face? I don't know. I don't know what the fuck is his face? Uh, uh, him. Yeah, Yazi, who's pretty good. Pretty good, I must admit. Sure. Pretty good, I must admit. Yazi is not bad. Um, and uh, you know, nice. Bulky, 26 beater can't be talking. Uh, Tiago was actually talking to me about it, and he's like, "It's a really good generic." He is generic, you know. Actually, I mean, you actually look at him. It's just one tuner, one non. And so, you know, it's another choice. Instead of going into uh, Black Rose, you could just simply go into him. I wish I would have got you a turn ago. If I would have got you a turn ago, if I would have got you a fucking turn ago. Then he would have MST he MST that call. I've been like, hell yeah, chain summon you bell, you bell tear from my hand that I drew. So I'm gonna not. Plus at all, I'm mean, actually uh, still I'm a zero out where I usually generally I like to plus, but on well, tactically it still would be even. But at least I wouldn't have to be negging from my no, come summoning from my deck. Nah, I'm trying to think if that what would that be? Okay, I'm guessing it's fine because you get quick on it, but you're not doing anything with it. Because I'm technically. I have to be Call of the Haunted, he MST it, but I, 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 he MST's my Call of the Haunted, I chain, I summon, I'm losing my, I'm losing my Call of the Haunted for sure, so I zero out, yeah, I zero out, but, if I didn't have it in my hand, I would still, I would still zero out, yeah, because go, going from the field to the, from the hand to the field is technically not negging, but, you know, I'd, of course, I would much rather draw, uh, you know, I would much, much, much rather draw something other than Terra because Terra is pretty much a dead draw. I might as well have not even drawn. That, that, that's how bad it is. Unless I have Dark Greffer. And I don't even believe there's a Dark Greffer in this. Is that? I don't think so. Maybe. I think just one. I don't know. I can't remember. It's been a long time since I actually eyeballed the deck. So, yeah, I'm not 100% I'm not sure there is. But, yeah. Sakuratsu Armor. You know, when D Prison's at 3. There's still Sakuratsu armor. There's always room for Sakuratsu. I remember when Sakuratsu armor used to be the shit. I, it was like 2008, where if you didn't have three Sakuratsu in your deck, you know, you're not doing shit. And, you know, there, when people were talking about hitting Sakuratsu armor, this is before Deep Prison came out. Or Deep Prison was uh, easy to access. I can't remember if it was one of the two. Okay. So you flip up your Falcon to do what? Why? What are you doing? You better not summon one from your extra deck. I will fucking quit. If you summon from one from your fucking extra deck, I'm gonna quit because you're bad. See? Everybody's on Shadals. Even the bad players are on Shadals. Flipping Falcon with no Chidals in the graveyard, Sakuretsu armor, blind spacing when you didn't even weren't even gonna do anything. Yeah, you did. No surprise there. Uh, no. Really? 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 You think I'm really? Really? You think I am nice enough to allow you to take back that fuck up? Really? You think I'm ni that nice? You really think I'm nice enough to allow you to put your Falco back down? When you're using fucking Shadals. Flip that bitch back up. Put that bitch back up. Just because you're bad doesn't mean... No. No. Even bad people are on Shadals. It's sad. It really is. It's really sad. 
everybody and the mother is on Shadal, even the fucking terrible ass player, so. As you can clearly see. Alright. This person has a pretty decent rating, so maybe he can give me a better duel than that fucking piece of shit scrub. Like, really? That wasn't a noob, that was a scrub. Because he knew, he hey, he knows that Shadal's good. A noob doesn't know that Shadal's are good. That, that was a scrub. That was a person who, bad at Yu-Gi-Oh, refuses to get better, and fucks up, and runs stupid shit, and just hops on it, and just net decks the shit out of shit. Telenites. Right? Right? Telenites? That's, that's the only deck I can think of that plays Rota, at the current moment. Yeah, Telenites play that. You gonna take the 200? You gonna take the 200? Thank you. I said, don't tell me you're bad too. Like, come on. That guy's pretty good. Ass ton of back row. Yep, it's Telenites. I'm going to normal summon. Okay. okay. Bottomless. Mm hmm. Go ahead. Okay. But that guy's really good. He's not out yet, but he's really good. So I gotta summon something in attack mode. What do I want to summon in attack mode? Hmm. Well, it's not like anything else is attacking me. Maybe I'll get lucky. So I'll go ahead and summon you in attack mode, despite, you know, with you with zero attack. Maybe I'll get lucky and draw into another uh, Yang Zing. That's what I'm hoping anyway. I'll draw right into another Yang Zing if you use that. Oh, right, right. He does have Pierce. I almost forgot that he had Pierce. I'm really surprised he didn't search for himself. Okay. Hmm. Except during the damage step. Okay. Well, I summoned during the damage step, so. That's fine. Mm-hmm. Right. I summon something in attack mode. Yeah, attack mode, because it's the other it's the opposite stat. You, you can't gun deal with me. Cause that is during the damage step. Go ahead and take your 700. Let me reverse. Well, I wish I didn't draw you bell, but I guess. Yeah, of course I drew you bell. Uh, 
the one card in this deck that I never, ever, 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 ever want to draw. And I drew it. Ever. Yubel is literally the worst card to draw. I would rather draw Terror. I would rather draw Ultimate Nightmare than draw freaking. Than draw fucking Yubel. Black Sea and the Exiton, I have one, two, three, four, five, six. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six. Damn, or even. And there is no way for me to neg either, so. Ah, uh, I guess I can just go into 101 and take him. Yeah, seems fine to me. If he got something, then he's got something. Like I said, I wouldn't be surprised if he's got like a Capulse or something. No word of warning, yeah. Another card, at one. That, of course, he has. Like I said, that that's two. See? It's a number generator. And if you think otherwise, you're incorrect, because it is. Good. Mm-hmm. Go ahead and kill my one more. Kill this. Kill this for me. Kill Bixie. So I, then I can go ahead and uh, use uh, this. Uh, it has to be in attack mode. Mm hmm. It's starting to make sense now, right? Anybody anybody here shocked that uh, he keeps getting uh, the back row? The, the cards that won? Anybody? Nobody? Nope. Everybody? No hands? That's what I thought. That's what I thought. Put you back. Put you back. Put you back. Shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. And you all too. Such a good card. Definitely a good card. Ugh. Like I said, I'll, I'll deal with Gundiva on my own time. Cut and foolish. Uh, yeah, I'll go ahead and send Chi one. That way, when he kills my Yangzing monster, I can go ahead and play Chi one effect. So, I'll just have you go ahead and attack him. Let's see, I just activate something? No? Okay. I said I'm fine. Just wish I didn't draw the bell. Go ahead. That's the only thing. I wish I didn't draw you, Bell. Anybody but you, Bell. You do not know how much this duel has been hindered because I have you, Bell, in my hand. But hey, glad I won. I, I should I should run like multiple you bells. Then if I ran multiple you bells, I would not draw you bells often. It doesn't make any fucking sense, but yet it does make sense if you really think about it. All right, shard. Like I said, Gundiva is not fucking with me at all. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So if I call the Haunted and I send it back and I make a B Rose, B Rose are in here, right? Yeah, I can make a B Rose who will be unaffected by trap cards. Interesting. Interesting. And then I could just go ahead and uh, star everything back. That's fine. Oops, I'm. Okay. That's a big call. Okay. You got that MST? Okay. Go ahead and bring back G1. I will sync for seven. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Synchro summon four. Oh, why do I need a black rose? But Synchro Summoning doesn't start a chain, so you can't respond. You had to respond to my content. What? Okay, what? Synchro Summoning does not start a chain, so you can't be like, oh, before you Synchro Summon.
What? I play. I said call the hunted. Is that? Oh, okay. Whatever. Okay. Okay. Whatever. Okay. You're not making any fucking sense, but it's fine. It's fine. Mm-hmm. Effect. Like, okay, fine. I'll do this the fucking hard way. Fine. I'll sink eight, then. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We're going for my boss monster, of course. Menu. Effect. One, two, three. Shuffle them back. You made it harder on yourself by doing that. Yeah, I knew you were going to quit like a little bitch. Fuck you. Trying to fucking interrupt me. I thought he could only get inherent summons. I don't know. I think Gen can Gendiva? I thought Gendiva was only inherent summons. Hmm. I don't know. I have to look that up. But like a little bitch. She's like, mm -hmm. can you fucking fucking just suck a dick? Just suck a dick. Suck my dick. I win. All right. And then I was gonna bounce those. Of course, kill that. What's in my graveyard? Lots of them, actually. Lots of open. So I'm gonna go ahead and activate this. Let me just go ahead and have fun with myself. Put you on top. Actually, no. I don't want you on top of the deck, actually. I want you in the very deck. I'll put one of you on top of the deck. You on top of the deck. And you on top of the deck. Yeah. And then you just go. Shuffle, 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 shuffle. And then go. Yep, and that's the reason why I did it. That's the reason why I. Well, of course, I'm going to leave you for later, but I left you because I knew I was going to get a mass command. I was like, I'm probably going to get a mass command, so I should probably eat a Suwani in there. And I did. So uh, I would have five cards, and he would have drawn into a second. So he's just like, nope, I quit. So uh, suck my dick, I win. There you go. But I, I think Gundiva can only stop inherent summons. I'm going to have to look that up because they're. I don't know, just the way that it's worded really doesn't make sense that it should be able to stop things like a monster summoned from Call of the Haunted, because you don't respond to the Call of the Haunted, you respond to the, you know, you respond to the Call of the Haunted, not a monster summoned, I don't know, I don't know, that could be tell, I mean, I said okay, and then I summoned him, and I was saying, oh, wait a second, like, okay, I guess technically he can respond to the monster being summoned by Call of the Haunted, but, I don't know, like I said, I think Gandiva's only in hand summons, but I'll probably look it up after this video is over, like, you know what, fuck it, I'm actually gonna look it up right now, fuck it, look it up right now. Uh, what was his name? Heroic Champion Gandiva Inherent Summons? In Inherent? I don't know how to spell Inherent Summons. Uh, da, 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 da. Let's go right here. Just was like to know why it can only affect Inherent Summons or can it just but some of the other high. Well, it doesn't negate summons. That's the only reason why Roach and Thunder King work against inherent summons. Oh yeah, I shouldn't even know. That. Okay, so it can, it can. So it could, it could hit me with the Call of Haunted. All right. Yeah, yeah. All right. So it's not like Roach or Thunder King. All right. Well, that's it then. <laughs> so he could have done that, which is fine because that literally just fucked him up even harder. Because I was just gonna go for Black Rose, and then we'd both be down. But instead, you want to go and be. Uh, I was thinking about maybe the Yazi. But, yeah, I probably would have. I was thinking of the Yazi, but, you know, he just he just made the decision for me. He was like, no, you're not going to go for Yazi. You're not going to go for Black Wolves. You're going to get your effect, and you are going to go for your boss monster, Baxia. I'm like, oh, okay. And then, of course, I'm going to bounce three. I'm unaffected by your trap cards. Even if you have that compulse, which you probably do, you're not going to play it because uh, I'm unaffected, of course. I'm going to bounce all this shit back. Put that little shard of green back in the deck. Shuffle it. You're not going to draw shit. I'm going to kill your monster. So, yeah. Uh, all right, I'm going to go ahead and call episode. So, I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of uh, Byron Y. So, thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. And I will see you guys tomorrow using Supervised Bell. Still working on a deck uh, right now. I'm not working on it in real life. Trying to put it together. I'm working on my Constellar deck right now. So, yeah. And I think I found something interesting to do with my Constellar deck. So, I'm going to be taking that. I've uh, been testing it, and I'm probably going to take that to the regionals. Hopefully, the cards get here soon enough. You know, I paid the extra $5 to order them super fast, so I got the two-day shipping. So, 
you know, it should be here by at least Saturday. I'm not sure what time the tournament is. I have to check, but if not, if I don't get those cards, then I might be in trouble. I might have to just ask my friends to be like, you've got any of these. Let me search through all of your Yu-Gi-Oh cards and let me see if you have any copies of these. All right, so I hope that you guys uh, enjoyed this episode of I'm the One. So thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. I'll see you guys tomorrow with Super Nice Thanks for watching.